Oh my god, that's a lot of hair. I think I went too short. Oh no. Imagine this three clip comes off as I'm cutting my hair and just do zero. <coughs> oh my god. Good morning, everybody. Hello, how we feeling? Um, okay, so this is what I was talking about in the last vlog. Also, now that I rewatched the last vlog and I edited it, edited it, uh, now that I'm done editing it and I got to watch it, literally all I talked about was coffee. After this, I will not mention coffee ever again. I'm just kidding. I won't mention it for the rest of the vlog. Um, okay, but this is what I was talking about yesterday. This is like the new thing. It's called the Breville something. Uh, this is what Ava's dad got us. So this is very different than the Keurig where you just put a pod in, press start. It has a piece of paper where it just has all the instructions and it feels like these instructions came from Ikea. They're very, very hard to follow. I already cleaned everything, washed everything, got it all ready and turn it on. Now I just have to like add the coffee beans and go for it, which I'm very nervous for because like I said, I've never done this. Um, and I feel like it's gonna blow up in my face. I don't know why, but I'm just gonna follow these instructions right here. It says making uh, espresso. So here we go. Number one, run hot water to preheat filter basket, quarter filter and cup. I already did that. I actually just emptied out the water. So number one is done. Number two, dry filter basket thoroughly. Let's dry filter basket thoroughly. Okay, that's pretty thorough. Set grind size to five and grind amount to three o'clock. Okay, grind size is at five uh, and then this is at three o'clock. Okay, here we go. Number four, select filter size. Wait, at what point do I put the coffee in? I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna put the coffee in now. Somehow we had coffee beans at our house, which we've never made coffee once since the day I moved in here. And I am giving credit to Ayla. I feel like these are probably hers somehow. Oh my God, they smell so good. Wow, coffee beans. Who knew? Uh, okay, so I'm gonna fill the coffee thing up here with coffee beans. Also, this bag of coffee is resealable. Love that. Okay, I filled it with coffee at the top. Now what? Do a single or double? I want a single, but I have to get a cup first. Okay, I got my cup, but you know what? I'm gonna try and make myself a cappuccino. Wait, no. I'm gonna make myself a macchiato. I don't know what it's called. I need milk. I wanna steam the milk. They have a steamer right here, and I'm gonna use it. So that's my first step. I'm gonna steam some milk. I'm also gonna trade my cup for my to-go cup, like I showed you yesterday. Okay, I don't know how much milk to add, and I don't, I don't, I literally don't know what I'm doing, so hopefully this this just goes correct. Uh, turn on steam. This is the scary part. Is it gonna blow up in my fucking face? I feel like it's gonna blow up in my face. Here we go. I'm just I'm just gonna go for it. Run steam to clear wand. Okay, I think that is clean. Now what? Is this still hot? That's still very hot. Um, excuse me, I'm filming something. Uh oh, you're doing it wrong. No, I'm not. <laughs> okay, so the next step is to select the filter size. I am gonna go with a single because I'm kind of afraid to have a double. Here we go. Step number five, auto start stop grinding. Press one. Wait, what? I don't know, I don't know what to do now. Whoa. It's doing something. Oh, it's pouring my, gr what the fuck? It's, it's giving me grind, it's giving me coffee grinds. Whoa, that was really cool. Tamp grinds, insert the razor, turn back and forth to trim. Okay, done. Press coffee to flush the group head. I don't know if I was supposed to do that. Insert and lock portafilter. Start extraction. This is the test of all tests. Let's see if it actually worked. That's it? I guess an espresso is like not that much, but I expect it to be a little bit more than that. Okay, now I'm gonna add my milk. Okay, I think I should have warmed up the milk a little bit more. And the last step is to add the caramel drizzle. I literally feel like I'm a barista. And I'm out of caramel. Okay, give it a little stir, 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 stir. This smells really good and I'm very excited to drink it. Okay, and finally, the taste test. It all boils down to this. Was it worth it? Is it good? That's pretty fucking good, what the fuck?
fuck, that's pretty good. Whoa, 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 whoa. Um, for what it's worth and all the work that had to go into it, I don't know how often I'm gonna use this. The Keurig is very easy, just put a pot in and boom, you have coffee. This, I feel like I'm gonna have to like wash and take care of, and it takes like a million years just to make one cup of coffee, but for what it is, it's pretty good. I was getting pretty hungry and I was thinking to myself, where should I go to eat? What should I order to eat? And I was like, you know what? I'm gonna make some stuff at home. Uh, I actually wanted Chick-fil-A pretty bad. And then I remembered I have chicken here that I bought a couple days ago that will probably go bad if I don't do anything with it soon. So I cubed some up and now I'm gonna cook it with some rice and just have myself like a nice little healthy rice and chicken bowl. But uh, yeah, that's what, we're, that's what we're cooking. Okay, I have added some rice. I mean, it looks very simple, but it looks good to me. This is pretty much the only thing I know how to make is frozen rice with some chicken. And sometimes I'll add like vegetables, but most of the time I won't because if you look really closely, see those little red things? I think those are vegetables, so I count those as my vegetables. Chicken and rice, literally, you can't beat it. The most simple meal in the world, but arguably the best. Okay, this is the final product. <laughs> I didn't add anything. It's literally just chicken, olive oil, rice, and what is it called? It's some sauce from like Buffalo Wild Wings. I think it's garlic parmesan, but it's very, very, very good. 10 out of 10. But for a drink, we got my water. I feel like as of recently, I've, I've had a lot more soda than I want, so we're putting in more water, at least for today. The lighting in my bathroom is absolutely dog um, okay, well, I told you guys I would be shaving my head at one point, whether it was yesterday or today, and it's gonna be today. It's gonna be today. It's gonna be today. Yeah, it's gonna be today. I'm gonna shave my head again, which, once again, I'm nervous for no reason. My head is currently shaved, so what is shaving it gonna do? <laughs> you know what I mean? I do have it on a three, which about a week ago... <laughs> When I got it shaved, we did it to a four. So now it's probably at like a five. Um, but I'm guessing my hair right now is at a five and this is at a three. So when I shave it, it's gonna be very short. The reason I have my microphone is because all the way over there, the sound is not gonna be picking up too great. Actually, I'm gonna show you guys. This is what it would sound like without a mic. And this is what it's gonna sound like with me over here and a mic and with me cutting my hair and a mic. You know what I mean? It just, it's details, my friends, details. The only thing is I can't hold this while I shave my head. So I'm gonna have to, I'm gonna have to clip it somewhere. One second. Okay, hopefully this sounds good. I don't know. It's probably gonna be a little quiet, but who cares? Yeah! I'm actually really scared. I don't know why. Here we go. Fuck it. Oh my god. Oh my god. That's a lot of hair. Oh my god. That's a lot of hair. I think I went too short. Oh no. Let me make sure. Oh my God. Okay, I think it's fine. Okay, time to lock in. Imagine this three clip comes off as I'm cutting my hair and just do zero. That'd be very sad. I don't think I've ever cut my hair by myself. You know what I mean? Like maybe I've cut it a little bit, but then someone like finished the job. I've never actually cut my hair and then just kept it. This might be a first for me. I wish I had eyes in the back of my head because I, I really don't know if I'm getting the back correct, correctly. I'm pressing so hard on my head it's making my brain vibrate. Who remembers when I shaved my eyebrows? That was probably the worst idea. I genuinely think that was the worst idea I've ever had in my life. All right. I think I'm done. Okay, the head is shaved and I feel good about it. I really do need the sides already cut again. And maybe I'll do a re-bleach. I would try to do my sides, but I know I would fuck it up so bad. So I'm not even gonna try. I did tell you guys I was gonna shave my head and there you go, shave my head. If you need me to shave yours or if you're looking for a cheap barber who can only do one haircut, hit me up, let me know. But uh, yeah, that's it. Shaved head, done. We're at the grocery store, uh, just got here. We need a few things, so I came to the grocery store real quick in the middle of the rain, which was very scary. And I think I'm not gonna bring you guys along. But yeah, I just need to go in there and get a few things, so that's why I feel like I don't have the vlog yet. But yeah, I'm gonna go in now. I'll talk to you guys in the next clip. See ya, mini zerp. zerp. You've probably never seen this side of my room before now that I am noticing. Signed Jim Carrey t-shirt. I don't know anyone else who has one of those. I think that's the coolest thing I own. Okay, well, that's it for today's vlog. I freaking love you, I freaking appreciate you. I had this idea that I want to do and I want you guys to give me your thoughts on it I want to take one comment from each vlog and put it at the end of the next vlog Basically like a shout out to someone in the comments Let me know if you think it's a good idea Should I give like a comment shout out at the end of every video starting now, but that's pretty much it I freaking love you guys. Thank you for watching day 39 tomorrow is day 40. What the fuck day 40 We've done 40 of these things. Okay, that's pretty crazy. Okay. Well, I love you. I appreciate you See you tomorrow for day 40 Hey! <laughs>